You can also combine multiple vectors together. So as an example, I'm going to define three vectors, A to be the vector 6, 1, B to be the vector 2, minus 3, and C to be the vector 4, 2. So suppose the question asks you to work out the vector A plus C. Again, notice I'm underlining the vectors. In the textbook, these letters will be bold. So write down the actual vectors you are using. A is 6, 1. C is 4, 2. At the top and the bottom numbers separately, 6 plus 4 is 10 and 1 plus 2 is 3. And there you are, finished. Suppose we do A plus B minus C, so all three vectors, write them all down, 6, 1 for A plus 2 minus 3 for B minus 4, 2 for C. Do the top numbers on their own, 6 plus 2 is 8, take away 4 is 4, and 1. Take away 3 is minus 2, take away another 2 is minus 4. And there you have your answer. Right, you can also do it with um, finding parts of that you don't know. So as a second example, that's my first example up there. This is my second example. Suppose we are given that the vector 2, 3 plus the vector 1, x is equal to the vector 3, 5, and we're asked to find x, then again, using the top and the bottom numbers separately, 2 plus 1 is 3, that works, and then if you look at the bottom number, we have that 3 plus x has got to be equal to 5. So the equation we are looking at is 3 plus x equals 5, so x must be equal to 2. A slightly more difficult example if we define three different vectors, this time I'm going to use different letters for them. P I'm going to use as the vector 3 minus 1. Q the vector 2, 0. And R the vector 5, 3. And suppose this time we're asked to find two lots of P plus three lots of Q minus four lots of R. Again, write it all down. Don't try and skip these steps, because the more you have write, written down, the more likely you are to get the arithmetic correct. So the vector P is 3 minus 1, plus 3 lots of Q. Q is the vector 2, 0, minus 4 lots of R, and R is the vector 5, 3. Work out each bit separately. So the first Two lots of three minus one, two threes are six, two times minus one is minus two, plus second vector, three times two is six, three times zero is zero, minus the last vector, four times five is twenty, four threes are twelve. Work through the top numbers first, six plus six is twelve, take away twenty is minus eight, Work through the bottom numbers, minus 2 plus 0 minus another 12 is minus 14. And there's your answer.